the size of our vision has to indicate the size of our prayer the reason why our prayer has to be bigger deeper stronger more consistent the reason why it happens at 9 15 on Sunday at 5 in the morning on Monday through Friday and the evening on Friday night the reason why prayers happen even after lunch you come here and there are people praying and we want to see a 24 hour an army rising up at home and at church praying why because the vision that we have it demands a different kind of prayer there are churches that don't pray and honestly they don't have a reason to because if the vision is to just keep your salvation and have your children not to drug smoke and get high then that vision doesn't require too much prayer but if your vision is to see thousands locally millions globally people be healed people be delivered and not just be saved but save others that vision demands your prayer life not just to be Lord God bless this salad and bless my family but has to be deeper and it has to be more somebody say amen let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ we live in a nation today that you know it goes over one week everybody debates about the Trump another week everybody talks about Hillary's emails another week everybody talks about uh, the bathroom issues and then last week the whole week everybody talked about the gorilla our world lives about just just shaking gorillas and bathrooms and that's what our world lives in and a lot of us as Christians especially Christians in America who believe we want to see our nation being impacted by God a lot of Christians they rise up and they say we need to put prayer back into our schools you know the government removed prayer from our schools but the reason why prayer was removed from schools because it was long gone from the churches and from people's homes why fight to bring prayer into schools when you don't even pray at home why fight to bring prayer into the government where you don't even come to morning prayer what we want to raise God didn't say a government is a house of prayer God says a church is a house of prayer God didn't say for the school to be a house of prayer God says for your house to be a house of prayer and listen the government can remove prayer from school that's what they do but you shouldn't ever remove prayer out of your own closet and out of your own house can somebody say amen and there's nothing wrong with petitioning the government and making your voices heard we need to do that but not at the expense of having a prayerlessness in our home so we can have prayer in the schools in Jesus name amen